everyone, it's Catherine and today we have workout 6 and it's actually the first workout of the week number 2. So, uh, and today we're we'll doing an amazing leg workout, legs and glutes actually, and we're going to use dumbbells and elastic band. Before we get started, I want to ask you to hit the subscribe button if you haven't done this already and if you have missed any of the previous workouts, I will put the link below so you go back and uh, catch up with uh, those workouts. All right, so if you're ready, prepare your equipment and we are ready to go. We start the workout with squats. I'll place here the weights on my shoulders and uh, the stance is uh, open. So you have the toes pointing out, the knees as well, and you have to sit on your glutes there so we'll do 10 repetitions but they have to be slower and uh, controlled so you're gonna feel uh, the squeeze on your glutes and the outer thighs here The next exercise of the superset will be body weight squats. So here we go uh, on a much faster pace and we will do 20 reps. So remember you have to squeeze glutes and quads and uh, the stance is also wider for this one. For the next exercise, I will use a plate where I put my heels on top so they are elevated and they will have to touch each other so the uh, toes are a little bit pointing out and from this position I'm squatting down, uh, holding the weight. So this is a hack squat there and it works uh, very well the outer thighs and the inner thighs here. So. If you don't have a plate there, of course, you can put something else like a book or something that is uh, elevating your heels. Uh, we will do 10 repetitions for this one and you go slower down and a slower up. So we are pairing these exercises uh, with elevated uh, heels again. Body weight squat will bring feet together and heels are elevated and we are doing 20 repetitions for this one. For our next exercise, we have a wide stance deadlift. So the toes are pointing out and the knees are slightly bent here. This is excellent for your hamstrings and the glutes and the tie between glutes and hamstrings. You go slower down and slow up. So you do 10 repetitions of this first exercise. So you squeeze as you go up and you have to feel the entire back of your leg. So this is the first part of four exercises. So we'll continue. The second one will be regular stance deadlift. So you bring your toes pointing in front of you. You bring your feet a bit closer together and you continue uh, with the regular deadlift. So the um, knees are slightly bent here you go slower and control for 10 repetitions for this one as well now for the third exercise of this giant set we bring feet together and we do pulse deadlift so we do two 
uh, pulses down and we return to the original position up. We'll do 10 repetitions for this one as well. For the next exercise we do good mornings, the feet are close together and place the weight behind the neck. So from here you bend front with back straight and here we control the movement all the way down and all the way up. We do 10 repetitions for 3 sets. Now for the next exercise of the giant set, uh, we do band kickbacks. You need to attach the band in a low position, in the door or in a piece of furniture. And we do a kickback and slowly return uh, front. Keep your back straight here and we do 10 um, repetitions for this one. Now we continue with cross body kickbacks and we have to do uh, 10 more repetitions here. This will work the uh, top of your glutes there. And again, we need to go slowly and uh, control here, slowly up, slowly returning to the uh, original position. So here, all these exercises are done without rest in between. So it's really a total burner for uh, the glutes. And now we keep the uh, kickback hold. So we bring the leg back and hold there for 10 seconds. You don't need to bring any uh, timer. You just count uh, to 10 slowly. So there you have your 10 count uh, hold. And without taking a rest, you repeat the entire sequence on the other leg, starting with, uh, with kickbacks, then we go to crossbody kickback, and then we have the hold on a kickback position. So you have like three moves in one exercise. So this is our giant set here. And we continue with uh, glute exercises now. And the first one is walk out. So from bridge uh, position, you walk out as far as you can and then bring the legs uh, back closer on the bridge position. And as you can see here, I uh, support the legs on the heel so that walks uh, works more the glutes here. So we're gonna do three sets of 20 reps for this one. Now without taking the rest, we continue with glute bridges and we have two sets of 10 here.
For our next exercise of the giant sets, we have in and out. So from the bridge position, bring the knees uh, close together and open on the side. And for the last exercise of the glute giant set, we do single leg glute bridges, 10 repetitions per leg. And now we continue with abs and the first exercise we do is leg raises. We're going to do uh, 10 reps for 3 sets. And now with very little or no rest, we go on to low scissors and we do 20 reps again for three sets. The third exercise of this giant set is the side crunches. Keep your chest off the floor and uh, squeeze your uh, obliques. You have to touch your ankles here. And for the last exercise of today's workout, we do frog crunches for 20 reps. Try to keep the resting periods to a minimum between uh, all the exercises and increase like that the intensity of it. I know today's workout was a bit longer, but legs it's always longer. I hope you enjoy the legs and glutes workout. Don't forget to go back and check the other workouts if you have missed any of those. And also hit the subscribe button and share the video if you like with people that uh, might want to go through a transformation. All right, I will see you tomorrow in our next workout.